Love it or hate it, broccoli is an extraordinary vegetable. I'm Susan Bowerman, registered dietitian, and today we're talking about why broccoli is a superfood. You know, when you hear the word superfood, it usually means a food that has extraordinary nutritional benefits, especially relative to its calories. Many of the superfoods we hear about are unusual, like acai or goji berries or mango stain fruit. But plenty of everyday foods are superfoods too, and broccoli is one of them. Here's why. The beneficial sulfur compounds that are found in foods in this family, like broccoli, cabbage, kale, and cauliflower, are highest in the broccoli. It also has the most carotenoids in the family, pigments like beta carotene, which is an antioxidant, and lutein, which is a yellow-green pigment that supports the health of the eyes. Broccoli is also high in vitamin C and vitamin K, and it's a good source of the B vitamin folate. It also supplies minerals like potassium and calcium and magnesium. Let's take a look at how to select your broccoli and how to prepare it. When you go to the market, you want to look for heads that are nice and tight and bright green. You don't want them to be brown or slimy. You don't want to see any flowers already starting to bloom. And then turn it around and look at the stem end. It should look nice and fresh and not be dried out. When you get it home, store it in the refrigerator in a plastic bag, a dry one. Don't wash it. You're not going to do that until you're ready to prepare it. Once you're ready to prepare it, just give it a quick rinse. And what most of the time you're going to want to do is to just cut the florets right from the stalk. So you can cut them right here, just right up at the top, like that, into nice little florets all the way around. Now don't worry, I'm not going to throw this stalk away. A lot of people do, but you don't want to do that. There's plenty of vitamins and minerals in the stalk as well. We can just break that up. But when you get to this part, what you can do, take those little extra leaves off and then take your peeler, because this part might be a little bit tough, and you can just peel away some of that tough part. And then go ahead and you can slice this if you want to, or you can chop it. But go ahead and make use of the stem because it's good for you and you can cook all of this together. Some people also like to shred this up and just eat it raw and make it into a salad. When you're ready to cook it, just steam your broccoli lightly until it's tender, just like you would with other vegetables. You don't want to overcook it because you don't want to destroy all of those beneficial nutrients that make broccoli such a superfood.